Well, I don't know if you get a better view of a site. What kind of things does this site have to offer? Well, young sweet potatoes, which I love. Washed out dirt. It's wet as can be. You can even see the smallest flake right here when you're seeing flakes and pieces like that around. When you're finding things like this, And uh, I do want to say this as we're looking at this. Uh, thanks for all the emails and the inquiries. And I have an a, a audio message out for Samson Boy. You said you watch all these videos. Here's another Hammerstone that you were talking about. I've got a ton. Problem is, for my um, all-mail file, I accidentally deleted the whole thing in my email. So if any of you out there and many of you have sent for you know, a response or an inquiry or something like that where I haven't got back in touch with you yet, drop another note, please. Uh, Samson Boy included. Look at that. And I've got a smoking awesome artifact right behind me. I love Hammerstone, so look at this thing. If you could feel the weight in, in my hand. Look at the work zones. So like I said, Samson Boy, there's no problem with getting you Hammerstone, even two and points. And You just let me know and we'll work out a deal. I often for such a small amount, I'll leave that right there. We'll come back to it, let me circle here. Uh, for such a small amount, I'll be happy to get you some great artifacts. I'm completely overwhelmed. Yesterday's videos are up, and uh, I mean, you just go down, I mean, look, I can't pick everything up. It's not laying around like Easter eggs, and this is not a high-class hammerstone. It was a tool, I can tell by the concave and convex, but I cannot keep them all. And there's tons of flint. And I'm just about out of here. It was a good view, still is, and this is opening sands. Let's check something out here if I can figure this out without messing everything up. One, two, that's okay. <sighs> I see, at least it looks right now, my, my estimate is, it is possible that uh, where my marker is, there's a G10. It's possible. This is, a, this is a crazy place. And I mean, you're talking about, you like hard stones. There's plenty here. They're not the best specimens, all of them, but they're all tools. And, uh, you know, uh, it's just, uh, where are you gonna start, where are you gonna stop when it comes to collecting flint? I usually take up the pieces that just cannot be good. Uh, Jiminy Christmas. My marker's up there, I walk right by this. And my marker's up there with a G10. I can see it from here. I don't know if you can see it. There's my marker. You can't see it in this camera. It's right up this line. And then I have a bunch of other artifacts. But uh, I want to talk about live action. If I didn't do this during the hunt, this is what you do. You miss them all the time. Well, this could be broken, but uh, that's looking pretty nice. You, you just don't see everything you need to see. And uh, just a beautiful hunting point. They were the Stone Age people. They needed this uh, for their food. They needed it as much as their food. Look at that. Dirty as can be right now, but look. I mean, I was beyond it. I was past it. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't going to look back. It's a great piece of rhyolite right there. I mean, that tops the first piece that I've ever found that really got me interested in collecting artifacts. Whew. Let's check this out here. I mean, I'm going down here, my eyes just went back and forth like a little pinball, and I said, oh my gosh, what is that? Now, I know some of you are pretty picky, and you say, I don't care too much for Marl Mountains, but out in the sun, uh, it doesn't get a whole lot better than that. Look at that, it was right down in line with this guy. Whew. Let me check something. Look at this, this is what I'm talking about. I expected absolutely nothing this morning coming out here, checking out sites or in, in uh, pods in site five. But uh, just a little bit off the tip, what a Guilford. But that's sometimes the best way to hunt, where you just literally are free, 
not to expect anything. That's a great piece, great piece. This is a great piece. This field finds, and I have some in my pocket right now. Uh, on my other pocket that I just not, look at this piece of strawberry rose blade here. I've got somebody who told me to keep a lookout for all that stuff. They love it. Not a problem at all. And then a, a great scraper right here. I don't want to hurry too much because I don't think I'll be posting another video today. I made a lot yesterday and I was just overwhelmed. That last quartz piece from Turkey Hill blew my mind. Remember the emails, everybody. If you did make an inquiry of any type, look at the work zone on this. God have mercy. Uh, and you haven't heard back from me, drop another note. You know how it happens. Mistakes. Email mistakes. All right. Let's look at this stuff. Live action. And this is the one I was gonna film. Look at that tip right there. It's thin too, I didn't expect that. I know Mom Mount must have worked like flat out dreams to them just to bring home the food. Appreciate everybody tuning in to Indian Trace. I guess that says a lot right there. Hope you find out there.